Hey, what up? It's your girl, Monica Zation, in the house. Today, I'm going to be talking about the sorrows of retirement in my country, Nigeria. I'm going to be talking about the pain and suffering that people go through just trying to collect their monies after they've retired. People work and give so much back to the country that they call their own. And at retirement, they have to suffer to collect their own pay. I was touched by a story I saw on Facebook um, two days ago about an old man that lives under the bridge in Lagos somewhere that doesn't even have families. This is a retired soldier that has fought and given so much for his country. This man has not been able to collect his pension, has not been able to collect any retirement money. Wow. What a shame. I've heard of people that are carried in their death bed. People that have carried with walking sticks, with wheelchairs, with, oh my God, that is so sad. It is so sad for many people that they have not made it in this world. Not everybody is rich. Those that have worked their lives hard for this country, Nigeria, they should not have to suffer to get their retirement money. There are even some young people that have worked and retired that are still waiting to collect money. My people, shame on the system. Many people will reply back to this message and curse me out and say whatever they want to say just because they are rich, they've made it, and they don't need retirement money. There are a lot of people that are poor and suffering that need it. So if anybody has worked so much and retired, I think they've earned that money. They shouldn't be writing letters. They shouldn't be coming every month, every day, every week to the office to show that they are alive to collect their money. We should create a system that knows where these people are and send them their money. Nigeria is 55 years. Independence, 55 years. That is not a small number. By now, our people should not be suffering like this to collect their retirement. People that worked for it, soldiers, police officers, civil servants that have worked, that have earned their retirement money, they don't need to suffer to get paid. They don't need to continue going to the government to register to get paid. Sick people ca carried by their parents, by their children, by their family members to come collect some kind of 50,000 naira or whatever they call it, maybe 25,000 naira, chicken change. And I heard also that the people that work in the retirement offices make it so hard so that people can get tired and stop coming so that they can take this money for themselves and use it to raise their own family, use it to build properties, use it to, 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 to take to uh, uh, America, Europe, all over the other world countries to build other countries instead of using this money to give to the people that deserve the money. All those thieves, all those people, that are stealing from our country, instead of giving the money to the right people, God will punish you all. You all will never enjoy these monies. You will use the money to, to be curious sicknesses that will never work, that will never be healed because you're stealing money from people's sweats. Change your ways. Give monies to the people that deserve their monies. Let them enjoy their lives at their old age instead of fighting and crying and living under bridges. Change Nigeria. Change my people and take care of your old so that your life and your words will be well for you. Monetization in the house. Always keeping it real. Peace.